Hi there. Today we're going to learn how to draw basic trees using Google Drawing. And I've got this um, page full of shapes that I've been playing on, but let me show you how to do it. So you start with a clean Google Drawing, and you really want to go to Insert Shape. And you can choose any shape. Maybe I'll pick the cloud shape. Click and drag. And the trick to trees is to get rid of the outline and to play with the color. So there we go. Now you want to duplicate it. So on some keyboards, you need to Alt D for duplicate, and some it's Command C for copy, Command V for paste. So the trick to trees is actually sort of layering them. And that's how you get these unique shapes um, when you're trying to sort of quote unquote build your tree. So let's try another shape insert, shape. And here I can look for, let's see, I think I will just try a triangle. So you can imagine, now don't forget, take out your border and change your color. You could command copy, command paste. To start to make all sorts of interesting little trees. There we go. So you see when I click away how they all blend together. Another trick so that you can move them around is to hold the shift button down and click over all of the shapes and go to arrange and group them. Okay, this like smushes them all together. So now if I wanna move my shape around, it's one group. Okay, so the basic principle here is to add a shape, duplicate it, and start to create a unique form. Let's look at some that I've already done. So you can see I use the heart shape here, the cloud shape. This was just sort of the teardrop shape in there. This one's the circles using lots of different circles. This one is an arrow. And as well, we wanna put in our tree trunks. You can change your colors. They don't have to be green. Remember, you can have autumn, reds, oranges, yellow. And we can certainly put pattern in all of these. Right now, we just have them really plain. So you can add details such as leaves, patterns, anything fun that you wanna put into it. So let's see, another thing that we can do is you can use your scribble tool. And the scribble tool right here will allow you to just draw a line. Maybe I want it like this. Now you can go and change the color. So this is my tree chunk. I wanna pick a brown. And you can change the thickness. So I need it to get a little bit thicker there. All right, I like that look. But what if I don't like uh, the curve right here? You can click on your arrow and make some adjustments here, okay? Now I can go back to my scribble tool and whoop, maybe I wanna build another one. Don't forget to change your color and adjust the thickness and that you can move things over with the arrow, okay? So when I move away, there we go. Um, if I wanna fill this in, I would just keep sort of adding lines or shape to fill in what I have here. So maybe I need a little rectangle. Um, I would try different shapes to fill it in. So that's the way to use your scribble tool. This was just inserting a rectangle and another shape. So it's a layering of shapes to get these tree trunks. That one was a triangle. So lots of fun things. And this is just the very beginning of this. So there's a lot of fun things you can do. So looking back on this, so this was just a start, starting to put patterns and lines and different things um, to get texture. So anyway, I hope you enjoy making trees. Have fun.